गाइस हर्षेर फ्रॉम शाउट मिल आउट एंड वेलकम टू अनदर वीडियो सीरीज ऑफ शाउट मिल आउट इन दिस वीडियो आई विल शो यू हाउ यू कैन एक्सपोर्ट योर ए वेबर ई मेल लिस्ट एंड इम्पोर्ट इट टू एनी अदर ई मेल लिस्ट इन दिस केस आई विल बी एक्सपोर्टिंग फ्रॉम ए वेबर एंड इम्पोर्टिंग इट टू कन्वर्ट किट सो टेक्निकली आई एम शिफ्टिंग माई ई मेल मार्केटिंग सर्विस फ्रॉम ए वेबर टू कन्वर्ट किट ए वेबर इज नॉट बैड बट दे आर पिटी लेट इन द गेम ऑफ सेगमेंटेशन दो दे have added feature for tagging and segmentation but i still think it's not so easy for an average user to start using it on the other hand i started using convertkit a while back and i kind of liked it so i'm making the shift it's a major shift for me because email list is one of the most important asset of any website all right so let me show you how to go about that Uh, so the number one, uh, the list that I am going to export is the Shout Me Loud one. That's where all the people who are subscribed to Shout Me Loud email newsletter uh, goes. So I click on Manage Subscriber. Make ensure that you know the list that you want to export is the same. So this will show all the user who are unsubscribed. If you are doing for the first time, it's a good idea that you know you click on unsubscribe. and if you see any user here select and delete them also do the same for the end deliverables because those people are as it is useless and you don't want to increase your list uh, with the number that because you know most of the email marketing service cost you for for the list right so once you have selected show all uh, what we do you know scroll down to the bottom and click on export csv all right so the my csv is being exported one thing which you know like once you have made the shift you also want to disable your list and uh, in everywhere you know you can't directly remove delete your list what you can do you can deactivate your list so usually when you deactivate it will take about 30 days for them to you know delete the list though if you don't want to get charged for that what you can do you can select all the users and delete them at one go uh, now let's go back to convertkit and i'll be importing user here one thing which you should know in the convert kit most of the thing that you're going to use is by using tags and segments okay you can create you can have people on your tags and your segment uh, at the same time i'll talk about that in detail in upcoming videos but for now what i have done is i created a tag you can create any number of tags by click, clicking on create a tag and so i created a tag called sml everybody imported click on input subscriber select the tag let all right that's done now just drag the list csv file over here that's email that's first name i hope all right so that's that's actually name and then let's date added special date Though you can always add more uh, custom field if you require, but for that you need to go to subscriber, and from there you need to add custom tag to one of your member, and then that will populate here. So last follow up that not important, not important. Add tracking. Okay, so this might be important. Uh, I can see refer, IP address not important, city is important, state. this would be important many times when you want to you know like target user based on their location there are many tools that you can use for targeting user based on the location i'll talk about that in the upcoming videos um, it will be out of scope for this video so once you know you just need to uh, select the the right field with the data that you have and once that is done click on import subscriber that's it uh, it would take about 1 minute to import everything though it won't happen instantly it takes about an hour because i think the convert kit team will manually approve that uh, i think that's it's because you know when you're importing a list it's not a double opt in single opt in and it's important for you know an email service to ensure uh, to check the integrity of a list they don't want to spam anybody and that's what convert kit is doing that's what most of the email subscriber uh, email service provider are doing and that's it so you know it will take about an hour I'll, i can also ping them over the chat and tell them like okay please uh, you know speed up my process and that's it so if you need to export your ever list you know what to do select your list click on subscriber manage subscriber export csv and then you can import it to anywhere that you like so this was the simple video in upcoming videos i'll talk more about email marketing because email marketing 
is the the most important thing to re-engage with your audience for now if you have any question if you have any suggestion if you want me to do a video on a particular topic feel free to let me know in the comment section below don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel for more such videos and if you share these videos it's actually going to help me a lot for now bye bye this is harsh Thank mm-hmm. you.